Hi guys, welcome back. All right, so today we're doing another YouTube creator reaction. Uh, this one's a little different because we're gonna actually be reacting to the caretaker side of things. Um, so this channel's called Sunshine Baby and it's a great channel. I've been watching them for a long time. It's primarily about a dad taking care of his disabled daughter. Uh, she has a few disabilities, epilepsy being one of them. Uh, but he's a great caretaker and I thought we'd just take a look at one of their many videos. Um, I'm looking at one of the older ones, I think it was around June, it's called First Day of Summer School, so let's check it out. And just a side note, I think for now I'm not going to react to actual videos of other people having seizures. If you've looked at my videos of me having seizures, I'm not comfortable watching even myself. So, um, probably not gonna, you know, react to somebody else. So just sign up for those, but you know, great that people can show themselves on camera having that because it just brings awareness and people can compare to themselves. So, um, if there is, cause I haven't seen this video. So if there is, um, you know, a actual seizure in there, I'll probably cut around that just, you know, you know. <laughs> All right, so let's check it out. So today is Raylan's first day of summer school. And I'm a little nervous about it. All right, nice cut of the school bus driving by. All right, I like that. I'm nervous because Raylan doesn't usually go anywhere without us. <laughs> she usually has either me or Abby or her nurse with her at all the time. And the, the school does have a nurse, so she'll be okay, but they just don't know her like we know her. But she'll be fine. She'll be fine. It's through the school that she gets all of her things like physical therapy and vision therapy and speech therapy. So it's great that she's going there. Uh, we're just a little nervous about it, or at least I am. Fair enough. Yeah, because you know their routine, you know what they need, you're much more comfortable being around all the time. I totally get that. Again, I'm not the actual caretaker in my situation. I don't have a child. I imagine, I can only imagine, it's a completely different scenario if your child um, you're having to take care of. But um, as far as my husband is my caretaker, and you know, Caesar situation. So, you know, when I call him, I'm like, hey, just so you know, I feel one coming on. I'm fine. I just wanted to let you know, just in case. Uh, but I think it's going to be okay. He's like, I'm 10 minutes away. I'll be right there. I'm like, no, 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 I'm fine. Just giving you a heads up. You know, if I don't call you back in 45 minutes after my post tickles, just, you know, <laughs> then, you know, I'll be right there. I'm like, you don't have to come. He comes every single time. So, you know, from a caretaker's perspective, I, I can understand how he's <laughs> like, I don't want to leave her alone, so get it. It's not so much that I'm worried that anything's going to happen. It's just that as a special needs dad, oftentimes you have so much control over all the little things. And then when you drop her off mm. with somebody else, you lose all that control. <laughs> so it's hard to let go of that. And in all honesty, I know how much sure. work it is to take care of Raylan. So I feel a little bad putting all that work onto somebody else. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't feel that way, but I do worry about how much work Raylan is right now for them. <laughs> I worry if she's gonna have a seizure there, and I know that she'll be fine during the seizure, but I don't I don't really want them to panic or overly worry or stress out. So all that goes through my mind as well. You shouldn't worry. <laughs> That's their job. They're used to it, I'm sure. But I mean, I guess you can't help as a father, right? That's your job to worry. But I mean, you can't help but worry, right? Uh, I can't, I can't imagine having to have, you know, you spend all day, every day with your kid and then to just first day of summer school, be like, all right, I trust you. 
health uh. wise, my biggest concern is that if she does have a seizure and she has excessive saliva in her mouth, that she'll choke on it and uh, that the people there uh, just won't Ooh. know how to use her suction machine to get that out of her throat well. But there is a nurse there and they should do just fine. And it's only for two and a half hours a day, so I probably just need to get over it. <laughs> in fact, Bless his heart. Oh, it's only two and a half hours, but still, I bet it's a stressful two and a half hours just knowing that there's so much that he has to do every day. And <laughs> I guess a lot could go wrong in two and a half hours, but gosh, to just, you know, have that me time or just, you know, give yourself a break. Take a little break, two and a half hours. You've earned it. You deserve it. Not that you, you know, need a break from your kid, but heck. I need a break from my dang kids and they are not special needs. They are just, they're kids. Jeez. <laughs> so, give me some It's already time to pick her up. So I'm going back to school to get her. How was school, Raylan? You have fun at school? She's giving you a little smile. You look like you're happy. Did you have a good time? She does. Oh. School left you in a good mood, didn't it? You're smiling. Maybe she likes a break too. <laughs> Just somewhere new to be, some new faces. See, you all need a break. It's a good thing. I'm glad you liked school today. Yeah, I sure am. That makes me happy, sweetie. That makes me happy. Such a good dad. School. Oh my a good mood, didn't it? So yes, Dad, I'm happy. Did you like your first day of school? You're not quite as smiley anymore. Oh, there's a smile. Did you like your first day? That just, that just, sweetie. <laughs> so that was the day Raylan had. I think she really, really liked going to school. And uh, I actually found out that uh, think you're somebody right. that she used to go to school with all the time is also in class with her. And uh, one of her previous nurses uh, said that it was her boyfriend. So I don't know yeah. if there's anything going on there. <laughs> so that's why she was smiling? <laughs> that explains it. Uh, and I'm not sure how she came to that conclusion. I think that they just sort of um, smile when they're around each other kind of thing. Uh, but I think... He might be a lot mm -hmm. like Raylan. I've actually never met her boyfriend, so I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's sweet. Anyway, but like I was saying, and it's a great example of it, um, there really is hope even when life seems hopeless. Raylan has so many struggles, and yet she smiles on school days. She smiles because she's part of a loving family. No matter what you're going through, you can, you can get there. Definitely. Through. There's always hope. Okay. So that was first day of summer school from Sunshine Baby. Again, great channel, great message, such positive, wonderful family. I uh, love watching them. If you haven't already, and I'm sure a lot of you already have, go check out their channel, subscribe, like, hit the notification bell, all that good stuff. And also, if you guys know of any other um, YouTube creators that focus on epilepsy with their channels, be sure and let me know in the comments down below. Um, you know, I know a few of them, but a lot of them haven't posted in several months or years. Um, you know, I'd love to get them back up and running if we can, if you know of any that are, you know, more current or whatever, uh, yeah, link their channel down below and, uh, see if we can check them out. Other than that, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe here, click the notification bell, and I will see you next time. Thanks guys. Bye.